Okay. Let me just do a very quick one on this. Rule 15. Understand the money and the happiness relationship. Some people say, if, if I could just have money, and I'll be very happy. And But what they forgot that there are some people who have a lot of money and they're miserable. They don't have a family. They don't have friends. They don't have a home. They, they, call, they can call their own. They are lonely. They are sick. Can't eat. Can't sleep. You must understand that money is not the problem. Then that is money the solution. You must understand that money is not what is causing the unhappiness. And you must understand that money is not what will bring happiness. Money is a miss and not an end. So if you are saying, oh, I want to have much money to do this and do that, you will be miserable. You will be miserable. One thing I know, money cannot buy your happiness, but can take away some unhappiness from your life. So you must understand the relationship between money and happiness. I want to run through the second law is uh, as law system says, know the difference between price and value. Now what we should have flash only six and it was telling the paper was something is only what someone is able to pay for it. So if you place an item and it says it costs sixty dollars and people are not willing to pay for it, at the end of the day you'll be forced to drop it. That is why um business owners and manufacturers actually do production and say, Okay, are the customers willing to pay? For this goes at this price. So it's something you should ask. And another thing again, not confusing price and values. Supposing you want to invest in a business, and the business requires a lot of people, and you see a place, maybe you you see a place to rent an office in. A sparsely populated area, but it's cheap. At the same time, you see a, 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 an office in a densely populated area, but it's cost. Now you have to compare price and value. What is the value in return? Do you prefer to go to the place that is cheap and then you don't get clients? Or the place that is cost and you get clients and you make a lot of money and you make a lot of sales. So you have to, you've got to understand that. And even as you purchase, purchase, uh, purchase items, you just have to make a very big decision. It might be cost, but you just have to do it. Hmm? You just have to do it. So I'll be doing rule 17 and retain in the next video.